AACPS families, we're going to take a look at navigating rooms in the AACPS app. You will need to download the AACPS app in your device's app store. Search for Anne Arundel County Public Schools and select the app with the AACPS Apple logo. Once you have installed the app, you'll be ready to go. The app will open to the home screen. Click on the Rooms icon in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. Here you will need to log in. You can log in with your email or phone number. Make sure to log in with the email or phone number on file with your student's school. To log in with your email, select the option to log in with Google or Microsoft and follow the security prompts. The other option is to log in with your phone number. Enter your phone number and you will be sent an authentication code by text. On the next screen, you will select your primary language for translations if needed. Click on More Languages if you do not see your language listed. Once you have your language selected, click the Save button. Now you're in Rooms. You will see your students listed across the screen at the top. If you have multiple students, you may need to swipe to the left to see the other students. Click on a student to view their classes, then select a class in the drop-down menu. Now you are in the class menu. The menu may appear differently for primary and secondary students. Scroll down to see all of the features, which can include the stream, behavior, materials, messages, class info, and classwork. Please keep in mind that at the beginning of the school year, it may take time for your teacher to set up their classroom and add content. So please don't worry if your students' classes do not automatically appear or if there is little or no content visible. At the top of the menu are your notifications. Click here to view any new messages or announcements. You can click the toggle button in the top right to view unread messages only. In the stream, you can view updates from the teacher, including posts, announcements, and classwork. Look for links and attachments that may include important files or documents. In classwork, you can view assignments and if they require action, if they've been turned in, or if assignments are overdue. Please check with your student's teacher about the preferred method for students to turn in assignments. The behavior feature allows teachers to award students points that they can use to redeem rewards within the classroom. You can view an overview of the student's points, any teacher notes, and an activity log. In materials, you can view files or documents for the class, including assignment documents and forms. In messages, you can view messages sent by the teacher and send messages as well. Click on the blue Add button in the top right corner and then select a teacher. Begin typing your message in the gray box at the bottom of your screen. If you have the app set to a language other than English, you can send messages in your preferred language and the teacher will receive them translated in English. And any messages sent by the teacher will arrive on your device translated in your preferred language. Please note that the translations are powered by Google Translate and may not always translate 100% correctly. You can turn translations on or off, and within the message thread, you can select the option to translate all messages by clicking on the three dots in the top right corner and then on the toggle button where it says translate all messages. You can also view attachments within the message thread. In class info, you can view any information the teacher shares about the class, including teacher contact information and other important things to know about the class. Enjoy exploring rooms and getting to know your student's classroom. For more information on accessing and navigating rooms, visit aacps.org backslash rooms.